Hey everyone, subscribe to my channel and keep watching me as I install this wig. What's up everyone? So today I will be installing this wig that I have gotten from Amazon. And I just wanted something simple and cute. It came with some nice 5D lashes. And the wig I had got, it is, um, I believe it's a 12 inch. I had washed it, pre-washed it and everything already. This is the closure part. The closure part is either you could do a center part or a little side part is not that crazy of a deep part. So now I'm just gonna go in and start corn rolling my hair back. I am not going to be doing uh, small, small braids. As normal, I hate doing small braids in my hair. And this is how the braids came out because I kept stopping. My arms was really, really hurting. So I did like five or six braids in my hair. Now I'm going to put on my wig cap. I'm using some got to be free spray to brush back all of my edges so I won't get any glue on my edges. And this also, protects your hair as well from the glue so now i am going to put my um wig cap on and i only use one i know normally some people use two or maybe a thinner cap but this is how i like to do it so now i'm just going to use some free spray around the edge part where I kind of already measured my hair. I hopefully it comes out right because I didn't properly measure it. So I just went in with my blow dryer to make sure that was all dry. And if you can notice, I have pulled the cap over my ears because I will be cutting that part out and making sure that it is secure on my head, the wig cap. So I'm just blow drying my hair because of the fact that I told you I have washed it. So I felt like um, the inside of it was still a little damp. So I just wanna make sure that it is completely dry. Um, if you want to know the products that I use for shampooing my wig, just write down below in the comment section. I will definitely let you know, or I will just put it down anyway down below. So this is the part of what I was saying about the cap. I just poke a hole like where the ear part is. Make sure you don't poke your ear, please, because you have to be safe. So this is a new method that I've been seeing a lot of girls doing, and it really, really works out. So now I'm just gonna go in with my Ghost Bond glue, my lace glue, and I'm just gonna put that around um, the edge of the wig cap of where I would like to place it. Um, I kind of did not measure any of it, so I'm just going to place it where I feel like it will secure and where it belongs. And of course the glue was giving me problems, but I finally, finally, finally got it. And I was like, you know what, let me just open it up and use my edge control, the comb part, and I'm just going to place it on. And I'm going to apply the glue in these areas maybe two times and then I'm gonna go in with my blow dryer. And you wanna make sure that the glue is invisible before you put your wig on. This really, really, really helps out a lot um, by using a blow dryer. It really, really goes quick. I'm going to apply a second coat right on the wig cap and then I'm gonna go in again with the blow dryer to make sure that everything is sticky and that the glue dry the way I want it to dry. So now I'm just 
looking at the back of the wig and I'm just adjusting the wig so I can place it on my head just to make sure that um it's in the right place of where I want the wig to lay I should have did this ahead of time but you know I'm kind of backwards on certain things but you know forgive me so now that I see that it's good I'm just gonna cut the excess um cap off all around from my head because it is dry um I'd still see a little bit of um of the glue ghost bond glue sorry y'all because i'm just like all over the place today <laughs> but i still see a little piece um is not completely dry but it's okay because i'm gonna go back in off camera and do it so now that i went off camera and did it i placed the wig on my head and make sure everything is secure and i'm just gonna go in and uh comb out my hair and then I'm just looking around the perimeter part of where the glue was placed to make sure everything is fine and that it's on properly. I'm going to go in with my free spray and then I'm going to use um, a black strip to put around the edge part and I'm going to let that sit for a while but before I do that I'm going to blow dry my hair just a little bit just a little bit just a little bit so it can stay and um i won't have to have the band on my head for a long long time so this is the black strip that i will be using like i said before and you can get that at your local beauty supply store and i'm just going to place that on like i said and we're going to move forward and we're going to wait until this bad boy dry so now i just cut off the long pieces and just shaping up the piece that i had left out and i am going to be doing a center part in my hair i just love 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 center parts so if you know me your girl loves center parts if you don't know me now you know but um yeah so i just combed out and just measuring how deep i want the part to go it cannot go that deep because of how uh small the closure is but it's a good enough size so i did notice because of the fact that i did bleach my knots the part in the middle was a little blonde blonder than my scalp so <laughs> i have to go in and correct that i'm going to show y'all how i will be correcting that as well but so far i love the part i love how it looks and now i'm just going to go in with my care care wax stick and mold everything down make sure the parts have um the care care wax on it because this really really helps me when i go in with my hot comb so yeah another thing is too when you go down with your hot comb first i'm telling you right now use the care care stick use any type of wax stick that you have it doesn't really have to be care care but i love care care never did any wrong to me like it always worked so y'all see how flat it's melted down i'm going to go over it again but i'm just going to use a green spray for now so now I'm just going to take the ball straight off my hair and I am going to cut the straight off my hair. So I did not do the same the camera because of the fact that um, I was like, you know what? It's just gonna be a simple part. I have to do my this man. Listen, yo, I didn't want to go too hard. Why phony people like, like the only text on holiday? Like happy Easter, Merry Christmas, way, happy birthday, happy birthday. Out. It ain't In my birthday. Really we don't talk like enough it. for them to so know that don't that hurt. I, hey, I, I don't call them, I don't text them, keep them moving. No protection. In the section, compilation. Uh, I'm just moving, um, recollection. I'm going to go in. Past life, move it all the time in the fast life. Shorty wanna get it with the fast life. I wanna move it all the time, but I get this dope. Pretty girl dance, hold up, girl dance, still. Pretty girl dance, hold up, girl dance. 
Got a Ferrari, uh, got a Ferrari, uh, got a Ferrari It's not me, that's them, they capping Spit it off at the top and I'm rapping Gotta keep it all the time, but I know Off for the top, but I keep that flow Flexing, wanna get a chill like Gotta make a meal, gotta deal like Wanna make a meal, gotta do like Wanna get real, surely what you wanna do Nothing what it feel like, hey, hey When I'm rolling up on the scene like, hey, hey We can do it all the time like, baby Surely said you wanna chill, that's your baby Other spray that I need to use, so that's what I'm saying and then I just put some spritz spray on those areas just to make sure that it's secure and it's down. This spritz spray was around for so long and y'all it still works wonders. And do you see the lace? You don't even see the lace in this. You don't see it at all. Okay, so now I'm just going to put my black shirt back on for a few more seconds and I'm going to make sure everything is tight and it's going to lay down properly. So now I'm just going to go back in with my hot comb to make sure everything is pressed down, is laid right. You always want to go back in and make sure everything is melted, okay? Make sure it's melted all the way down. And I am definitely feeling this hair already. I just cannot wait to style it and do what I want to it because I still don't know if I want it long or if i want to um cut it into a bob y'all know i love my bob so it's 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 giving me bob <laughs> it's giving me bob just cut it because you know your girl always look good with a bob so now i'm just figuring out what i really 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 want to do and i'm just going to go back in with the hot comb because i see an area is just sticking up and looking too crazy for me, so uh, that's what I'm gonna do. Why phony people like the only text on holidays? Like happy Easter, Merry Christmas, happy birthday. Happy birthday. It ain't my birthday. We don't talk enough for them to know that don't that hurt. So this is what I'm going to do to cover that area that I felt like that was bleached too much. Um, I will never use the fully, uh, I think I used the 30 developer. I should have never did that. I should have been watching it. I was trying to multitask, but it was not working. So I just went in with my James Charles, um, palette and I just used the black, um, color, eyeshadow color to correct those parts that was, um, looking crazy. And it definitely helped out a lot, like a lot, a lot. Like it looks so much better. If you can tell, it definitely looks better but yes that's all you have to do if you feel like um one of the parts of your lace is looking really 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 um too blonde so now i'm just gonna go in with my mousse spray and i'm going to use that to uh do my baby's hairs and I'm going to cut the baby hairs a little bit because they are extremely too long. I do not like to have long baby hairs. And it's only a center part. So it's like, why would you need all of those baby hairs for a center part? I mean, I you know, everybody's different. But for me, no, I don't like all of that. <laughs> I'm going to just cut it. And, you know, I like simple stuff, but cute. Don't get me wrong now. I like me some baby hairs.
find a grind to find I know. Grind to find the blind mind to show. Keep the flow, I know to let it go. Off the top the dome, I let it blow. Get it like oh, what I get flow, but I keep that oh. What I get team, but I got that whoa. What I get team, but you got that whoa. Get it like everybody wanna chill when I feel like ooh. Hold up on the scene, but I green like ooh. Wanna be the flop, but I thought you knew. What I get chill when you wouldn't want So now that I got my baby hairs together and it's looking the way I want it to look. I'm going to put my black strip back on, but before I do that, I sprayed a little bit of spritz spray and some got to be. I just love to make sure that everything is secure. So if you see me spraying a lot, y'all don't have to do what I do, but honestly, this really, really helps your baby hairs, okay? It is not gonna move and it's definitely gonna secure everything. So that's what I'm doing right now. And I'm gonna leave that black strip on for a little while like I did the last time. so i decided to cut my hair into a bob y'all i just love me a good bob and i was like you know what i haven't had a bob in a long time but if one month is a long time then whatever but i was definitely feeling myself i really really love doing bobs in my hair it's so simple it's chic you could definitely wear it with anything um that you want to i just love bobs period but i don't know if i'm feeling this length um i think i'm gonna cut it up a little shorter if i don't like it but yes so that's what i'm going to do i think i'm gonna cut it shorter because it's cute don't get me wrong but i always like it a little bit shorter so i'm just going to flat iron these parts and um then i'm gonna cut it a little shorter Got a Ferrari, uh, got a Ferrari. It's not me, that's them, they capping. Spit it off at the top and I'm rapping. Gotta keep it all the time, but I know. Off at the top, but I keep that flow. Yeah, so this is the length that I normally wear when I do bobs. I really feel like this length looks so cute on me. It is manageable. I don't really have to do too much. But I am definitely feeling this hairstyle. It definitely, definitely, definitely fits my face. And when I put my makeup on, everything is just gonna, it's just gonna come together. Y'all comment down below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel as well. But y'all comment down below if you like this bob. It's definitely, definitely cute. It's easy. It's doable. Like, you can never go wrong with a bob. And I just love this wig. This wig, the texture of the hair, everything is so good. It's full. Um, I really like it. I'll put the information to this wig down below. <laughs> as y'all can tell, I'm definitely feeling myself. And I'm just going in cutting the rest of the little pieces off making sure that is all off and then i'm just continue to keep bumping and making sure everything is straight but make sure y'all comment down below if you like this hairstyle on me and let me know would you try this hairstyle out like so nice so i hope that you like everything that i have shown y'all i love 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 this wig make sure you like comment subscribe to my channel